Hey, thanks for watching Four Color Commentary. I'm Mark Allen, and this is another Affordable Firsts. And of course, first appearances today are all the rage. Um, lots of speculation out there, but I tell you, first appearances have always been the rage to true comics fans who uh, love the characters and they want the first appearance of that character. They want uh, the comic book in which that character first enters the fictional world of comics. In this case, we have Green Lantern Quarterly, Green Lantern Corps Quarterly Number One from the summer of 1992. Uh, first appearance of Jack T. Chance, one of personally one of my favorite Green Lantern characters. The story is one of Hal Jordan telling stories of past Green Lanterns to entertain the troops, and uh, he tells a story of a Green Lantern that comes to a, a world that is just overrun with crime. Uh, nobody, I mean, there's just it's just a bad, bad world. And um, that Green Lantern, that first initial Green Lantern, doesn't make it very far. And we find out in the story there's a history of Green Lanterns not making it very long on this on this planet. Well, the the ring chooses a guy named Jack T. Chance, uh, a, a, an honest man who is a seriously bad dude. And um, you know, in the course of the story, he does some cleaning up of the planet, uh, especially of one major bad guy, and gets called before. Uh, the Guardians of the Universe on Oa, uh, to uh, complain and tell him they don't appreciate the way he's doing the job, and they're going to have to do it their, he's going to have to do it their way. To which he says, okay, well, thanks, but no thanks, and you can have the ring back, I don't care. And, uh, you know, they, they quickly see that, um, you know, he's the man for the job. In fact, one of my favorite quotes from this story, you have one of the Guardians, I think it may be Ganthet, though they never say, but he says, he actually says, uh, Jack T. Chance fills the two prerequisites to be a, a, a Green Lantern, he is honest. Nowhere do the re requirements say he must be a nice sentient. <laughs> and I, I just like that. He goes on to say, as Chance himself points out, he may be a bad man, but he will be our bad man. And so Jack T. Chance goes on to become the Owens bad man to be Green Lantern to clean up his sector. And uh, just a great uh, Green Lantern character. You can get it very affordably right now. I've seen these as low as in nice shape and high grade, uh, as low as 99 cents on eBay. I'm sure you can find them in the cheap boxes, but uh, it's an affordable first. Green Lantern Corps Quarterly number one uh, from summer of 1992. First appearance of Jack T. Chance. Go out there and get it. And thanks for watching Four Color Commentary.